everybody this is Caesar with small engine velocity I am on my lunch break at work walking around the park that's across the street and I just wanted to share a new tool that I have in my toolkit for whenever I start moto vlogging again and if you're wondering why I'm squinting yes it's super sunny outside today and it would have been a beautiful day for riding but unfortunately that's not it wait quick update on my shoulder though it is feeling a lot better. I've quit taking pain medication. I have a November 5th appointment, and hopefully after that I'll start PT. Uh, I've been trying to take it in and out of the sling and do a little bit of exercise so that it, it uh, can uh, adjust. Um, I can start kind of pre-working it out before it's time, so hopefully that works out well. But anyways, just in case you're wondering, the drone that I got is the DJI Spark. It is very small. If you want to look at the uh, proportions to my hand, it literally fits in the palm of your hand. And there is palm flying, by the way. You can li li land and take off from your palm of your hand. And then, of course, it has like the Mavic looking control, uh, except for it doesn't have the heads up display in here, but everything else is pretty much the same. Uh, there are a few quick buttons and function coat buttons in here. Uh, unfortunately, these don't come off, which is weird because when you fold it up and you try to put it in your bag, then these things are being bounced around. There are some guards that you can buy that you can put on there or a 3D print that I plan on doing. Uh, also comes with some extra propellers. And if you look around, it's a pretty uh, interesting place. It's a park that just got finished being built. There's a lot of little waterfalls and trees and stuff. The growth hasn't come in yet, um, but I think it's gonna look good. I think we'll have a, an interesting uh, little flight. So I uh, just wanted to introduce you to the newest tool that I have in the toolkit, uh, a little short video. Uh, let's go ahead and do a little fly around and I'll give you a little bit of what I think at the end. All right, thanks.
So, I did a little flying, uh, 11 mile per hour crosswind on a sunny day, and it held it like a champ. It wasn't uh, flying all over the place. Uh, you could tell that it was flying at an angle. It was trying to hold position and speed, so it kind of slowed down to uh, adjust. Uh, but it was good. Uh, if you're wondering how I got this, I had a Mavic Pro, a Mavic Standard 3, and uh, I traded it. So basically I got a small, pretty much a small version of the exact same thing that happens on the other one, except for this one has sensors and a bunch of different modes. And uh, all around, flies about the same. So the cool part is, it's a little tiny box and it'll fit perfectly in my backpack for whenever I do moto vlogs, go to car shows and whatever. So it's a cool tool to add to my repertoire. Anyways, uh, hope you enjoyed the footage. Uh, like my little tiny video that I have. Uh, I think it'd make a great uh, moto vlog, uh, a moto vlog uh, drone. It's very portable, very easy to take around. I love it. I haven't got to really experiment with any of the other flight modes. Uh, there's a sphere mode. Uh, you can uh, do a, a panoramic mode and stuff where you can stitch stuff together, but <laughs> all in due time, right? All in due time. Anyways, thank you for watching this little tiny video with the new tool. Hopefully I'll be able to use it in more moto vlogs in the future whenever my arm is whole again. So don't forget to like, subscribe. If you have any comments, leave it down below about this drone or anything about me and I'll be happy to answer. Thank you. All right, bye.